just like our friends. We're gonna have just a little tiny bit of uh, base therapy, you know. When you're a junkie for the sound, you gotta have it, you know what I mean? Sunday going thus far. You like it? And I'm just here in the man cave, you know, here in the man cave, chilling here in the dusty ass man cave. You know, oh, I'm happy to be right here. Ain't no better place to be on earth than here. To be somewhere, being happy, content would be. A word that's more suitable. Content to be content. You need. You don't need no body but the good Lord yourself. Your spirits be tight, so your spirits don't be tight. You need beating the heat and all that. We're gonna have us a little bit of a. We're gonna have us a little bit of base therapy. We gotta have some yitty. There we go. We done forgot. <clears throat> we done forgot what 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 what, what tempo I was on. came from uh, uh, I forget the boy name I forgot the boy name already him and his uh, portrait of Tracy right matter of fact I don't know if anybody's ever shown you this you know slow it down and show it to you so I'm going to make an attempt to do so. And let's see. What you want to do is you want to hit right here. On the fret. See that fret right there? You want to hit. You want to you wanna pluck the string, but you want to just lightly. See that? Travel up so that this would ping. So you own this one right here, and then you come here, and you gotta hit it just before, just before the fret. See that? So it's on the fret.
to your A string and you say A B C and then you I like to make it drag, you know, like that, sustain as it was as you if you will. And you have to take your finger. go that way and then you like that right so Then I drop down here to the F. But they got some way down here once you do, and then down here, right? So one more time, yeah. You gotta put your fingers all out. But I be seeing little kids on, or little people, or small, someone small on a regular size guitar. They even stretch their hand way down here. I can't do it. But anyway, that's the beginning of the portraits of Tracy. And uh, when I get off of here, I'll remember his name straight. I don't know why I can't remember his name. I keep trying to come up with Paladino, but not Paladino. Whatever, I'll be back with his name, god dang it. <laughs> but anyway, that's how it goes, so. G string is real funny because you can hit on the fret on the rest of them. But this one you just gotta be right behind that fret. See that's on the fret. This one is just behind the fret. He the one did this, so he's this uh, guitar player, uh, bass guitar player. He plays all kinds of music. Um, Jocko, Jocko Pistorius. That's he the one came up with this here. Did a lot of different things, trying to be different, but at the same time, on time with everybody else. You know how it go. 
You want to be different. I'm gonna give me uh, another four string <clears throat> that eliminate having to avoid this because you don't use it as often unless you're gonna you know you want to be ready that's what the five string is for so you be ready you don't have to go up here and start uh, toning down or up or whatever you know what I mean or you're gonna understand what I mean if you don't I guess you're not trying hard enough but you don't have to uh, tune it down or tune it up, you know. Like, for instance, you want an E flat, right? That's E, but you need an E flat. So. Here's E. E flat. Strings. That way you don't gotta change nothing. You just go ahead and play whatever it is you're gonna play. Let me tell you something. <laughs> Who you would think ain't got it, man, they watch him like a hawk. <laughs> they watch him like a hawk so they can get every little, everything, <laughs> everything uh, uh, Victor Wooten does. They, boy, they want it to the science. Man. So it, it comes stealing. <laughs> but they be stealing hard. You know. They be on every little no every little little fade that's on there, so so you gotta be like that too. I'm just having a chew. I'm just having a chew. Don't have a cow. Cause I'm missing it. Let's see. Let's see.
climbing the ladder. Isley Brothers, right? which
like one or two parts be one one is um not not kinda kinda
something like one of them <clears throat> living life life in LA or whatnot.
I'm going to shut this damn show <clears throat> so I don't have to break it all up like itsy bitsy pieces of food on the plate, baby. Just a little something. And we'll be back with some more. <laughs> and I mean, you know what? <laughs> I'm going to uh, take a look and see what I'm going to pull out the dust sack in the old fucking man cave back here. your main man no love in the man cave don't be afraid to come and listen every now and again you did and I'll be back with some more good shit <laughs> You're gonna go here in the fifth, then you can hit your an octave. So that'll be actually the fifth and the eighth here. And then back here will be a a one and a five. One and a five is the tonic up here. And then your five is down here. And then your octave down here, which is your eighth. So see, A, B, C. That's one, two, three. D, four, five, Z. 
Damn. Seven, right? Eight. So let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. See that? A. A. And an octave. This is eight. This is one. This is eight. This is one. So if you ever hear it and you get confused and it say seven because it's not going to go any further, it's just going to be here. When you hear uh, A7, that just means that's a G. See that? play so raggly if you are raggly because we're just having a bass too it's going to be who you started from the beginning started from the bottom now we're here what this thing was off so off i, I didn't know it is you know what i'm saying what i thought was a g was something else uh it was all way low. I didn't, I didn't, I started out just trying to learn this bass guitar by myself, right? Actually, that D is a four, right? That sound more better than just or A and C. Let's see what happens. See that? This is an A, A, and a C, right? So y'all guys see me? That's the A. That's the C. We're going to finger that up right quick. And actually it'd be A, C, E, right? It is a... Because it's whole step. So it'd be A, B, and then B to the C sharp. Because it's a whole step, then another whole step, which will be E flat, right? So, whole step, whole step, whole step, let's see, so one, two, this one down here even though it's gonna be uh, too low and it sounds muddy say okay what if we found the A that's up higher okay let's go here now that's A E right there when you go up to the 12th fret that's an A E to the AC by going back this way. See that? So, that would be minor. Now that's a major. 
A and C sharp is major. Now, if you can, watch this. We'll be back, okay? Don't fret. Don't fret. You're going to learn this. <laughs> Don't fret. Don't fret. You will leave with, here with something. You might be a little jacked up. <laughs> yeah. As a musician said, you might, hey, man, don't worry about it. You might leave here a little fucked up. But when you get on a gig, <laughs> yeah. Pay attention to TJ and me. Listen, sometimes it's the goofy some bits to teach you something. <laughs> Well, I'm old love. That's my bass kit. Let me get it right. This is my bass kit. This is my bass. And this is my guitar. I have two of these. Here they are. And we'll be back. If you're interested, you ain't got to stop your stinking self right over here. Go wherever your ass is itching to get to. But I am is I'm is more love, and I'm is gonna continue to give you a little bit of both the bass and the guitar. Yeti. So I'll be back. <laughs>